How's it going guys? Laney HD here. Today we are going to do our first benchmarking video um, now that I have the MSI GTX 960 running in SLI 4 gig. So hopefully this video we will be able to get some good results, uh, see what kind of difference we get and kind of put to rest a lot of the rumors and hate going around on the internet about the graphics card itself and even the graphics card running in SLI mode. So with that said, let's jump right into it. Today I'm using FureMark, which is a, an open source software you can use to stress test um, and run benchmarks. Um, and like I said, it's free. You have all your custom presets. So you can change the resolution, full screen or not, and you can put anti-aliasing on or off. So for the purpose of this video, we're going to just run it off with it off. As you can see, I have SLI disabled. All right, now let's go ahead and run the first benchmark with just the single GTX MSI 960. I've done a bit of uh, benchmarking and stuff, uh, obviously, before this video just to kind of see how everything works um, and so far things have been going good um, one problem I have is my cooling as you can see the max temperature right now is at 66 degrees that is the card on top um, hot air rises so pretty much the cards heat each other which is what why SLI kind of why they run so hot um, so I'm gonna need to get more fans for now, but eventually I'm probably going to water cool the uh, GPUs and the CPU once I get enough money. Um, as I did just spend a good bit upgrading. So, and I'm not rich, so fortunately I can't just have the perfect computer right when I want it. It takes some time to save some money. So, anyways, this test is uh, almost done. Alright, so there's our score. We've got 200, 2,321 points at 38 frames per second. So let's paste that there. Now, let's turn SLI on. I gotta close this first. We now have an SLI on. Okay. So let's go ahead and run the exact same benchmark now that it's in SLI mode. See what kind of difference we get. Yeah, so I don't like the uh, GP running at 66 degrees, obviously. This is a stress testing uh, software, so it is going to stress test it, but um, I, it's a little high for me. I know 70 is what they say is the safe mark, but you don't want to go higher than that. I, I'd like to stay at 60. Um, and under full load in SLI, um, my temperatures usually are around 64 to 65-ish, sometimes a little, sometimes a little higher but um like I said I'm gonna get some cool to fix that um all right so we are at 91 percent and let's compare the results all right so let's pull up our score sheet okay so here we have non SLI and here we have SLI so as you can see there is a pretty big difference um, 38 frames per second versus 70 um, now let's do a little math find out what percentage of an increase we have going from a single GTX MSI uh, running them in SLI so then we're going to divide it by the original number, and times it by 100, 
And there you have it, guys. So we have an 81% increase. That's pretty damn good. I, and, I, and I think that goes to show a lot. Now, I know this is only one uh, benchmarking software, but I'm going to be doing multiple videos. I've got Combustor here. Um, I actually got in contact with uh, Heaven Benchmark. Um, and you have to email them and tell them why you want to use it, etc., etc., to be able to get the free trial. Um, so I got that free trial, so we'll be doing a video on that as well, testing it out. Uh, so stay tuned for that. What I will also be doing is running this exact same test, but what we're going to be doing is running it overclocked. So here's one of my overclocks I have. But yeah, so that's what to look forward to in the future. But for now, I just wanted to go ahead and get this video out to show you guys the uh, the difference I'm getting. So with that said, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it, but most of all, I hope it helps a lot of people um, decide uh, whether or not they want to go SLI. Because I spent a lot of time and research trying to figure out whether or not I wanted to upgrade to another better graphic, single better graphics card, or just spend the 250 and run an SLI versus spending three or four hundred five hundred dollars for a new one so yeah as always take care